Welcome to Books for Success. Today, we're unraveling the insights from Eat to Beat Disease by William W. Lee, MD. Eat to Beat Disease discusses a life-changing guide to many healing foods to add to your diet that support the body's defense systems. The author, William W. Lee, MD, provided scientific evidence and recommendations about foods you can add to your meal plan and choices that will make the plan better. Respected scientist, physician, and successful author Dr. William Lee has served on the faculties at Harvard, Tufts, and Dartmouth. A guest expert on CNN, The Dr. Oz Show, and MSNBC, Dr. Lee has also been featured in USA Today, Time, The Wall Street Journal, The Atlantic, O, oh, The Oprah Magazine, and Wine Spectator and on NPR. If you like our content, hit that subscribe button and ring the bell for notifications. Don't be shy about smashing that like button if you discover something valuable. Let's grow and succeed together. Health is not the absence of disease. The world needs to focus on fighting a wide range of diseases. You have a huge chance to take charge of your life using food to transform your health. You can also decide what to eat and drink based on scientific evidence obtained from testing foods with similar methods and systems that have been used to discover and develop drugs. When we study food like medicine, the data clearly shows that food can influence our health in specific and beneficial ways. Doctors know that poor diet is linked to preventable disease, and food is becoming a topic of ever greater significance in the medical community. Some advanced medical schools have included culinary classes in their curriculum. Food is easily accessible, and diet interventions do not depend on expensive pharmaceutical treatments. The five defense systems against disease are angiogenesis, Regeneration. Microbiome. DNA protection. Immunity. By living your life correctly, eating properly, and focusing on overall well-being, you can ensure all of these systems are firing on all cylinders, keeping you strong and healthy. This summary will give you the knowledge and tools to make better decisions when choosing what to eat daily. It is intended to help you live longer by eating foods that you like. This read is for those keen to remain in good health or anyone who wants to focus on their health and prevent the development of disease in the future. Regeneration is the maintenance of existing organs. You might want to ask how organs are maintained and grown. The simple answer is stem cells, which are very important to our health. A sudden halt in the workings of the stem cells will see any individual dead in a week. From the moment an individual is conceived, stem cells play a crucial role in maintaining overall health and body. One of these stem cells' incredible attributes is their pluripotent. This implies they can create any cell or tissue in the body, from the muscle to nerve to skin, brain, and eyeball. When a smoker inhales cigarette smoke, it lowers the amount of oxygen in the lungs, which begins replenishing stem cells in the bloodstream. However, chronic smoking ultimately reduces the number of stem cells reserved in the bone marrow, leaving limited cells available for regeneration and maintenance over time. If you don't smoke, make sure you are not near those who do, as you are not safe. Secondhand smoke is just as dangerous. Heavy drinking also kills stem cells. You can avoid these risks to your stem cells by minimizing your exposure to tobacco, alcohol, and air pollution. Beverages and food can prompt a person's stem cells, improving the body's capability to heal and regenerate itself from the inside. The new approach to regeneration does not require the attention of a doctor, nurse, hospital, or the use of injections. The stem cell pool is tapped into dietary regeneration to replenish health. Some foods improve the activity of stem cells and foster regeneration, while other foods can also cause damage to stem cells, rendering them inactive. Whether you want to optimize your health, age gracefully, or you have a severe and persistent health condition like heart disease, cancer, or diabetes, then there's a means to use diet to notify stem cells to help you heal from within. The human microbiome is an assemblage of multiple species that are mutually beneficial. You are no longer just human, you are a holobiont. The word holobiont depicts an organism that operates as an aggregation of numerous species that are mutually beneficial. You are a holobiont because your body is not a distinct entity but a highly sophisticated ecosystem encompassing 39 trillion bacteria, primarily good, abounding within and on your body's surface. These bacteria are numerous, with their quantity approximately matching the cells present in the human body. When all these bacteria are combined, 
They weigh about 3 pounds, which is the equivalent weight of the brain. They are surprisingly durable, withstanding strong acid in the stomach and a range of different substances that dwell in the intestines. Microorganisms were previously confused by those in the medical world. It was assumed that these organisms were nothing more than harborers of disease and should be destroyed, killed with antibiotics, and sterilized. But through research, we now know that most of these bacteria within our body function in highly complex ways to protect our health and even affect our attitude. As very active squatters, healthy bacteria form a complex biological system known as the microbiome, which interacts with your cells and organs in various ways. Furthermore, a type of gut bacteria called bifidobacteria was revealed to reduce stress and anxiety via distinct gut-brain interaction. Bacteria influence stem cells, angiogenesis, and immunity. They can even impact our social behavior, hormones, and sexual fitness. Our microbiota can distinguish between life and death, between developing severe disease or withstanding it. Bacteria eat what we eat. They break down the food and liquid we consume and build beneficial or toxic byproducts that affect our health. The gut microbiome purpose is highly affected by our diet. During our lifetime, 60 tons of food will pass through the digestive tract. What we eat is what our bacteria eat. Prebiotic foods can enhance bacterial function. By consuming foods that naturally contain healthy microbes, new bacteria can also be introduced into our ecosystem. We continuously introduce new bacteria into our bodies throughout our lives, and we exchange bacteria with family and friends. A kiss can introduce as many as 80 million bacteria. Protect your DNA, it contains the source code of life. The DNA is your genetic blueprint, twirled into the shape of a spiral staircase known as the double helix and reduced to fit within a cell. The staircase consists of genes inherited from your parents. DNA maintains over 10,000 naturally transpiring damaging events every single day. These damaging events can result from errors occurring due to chance or as side effects of something harmful within the body, such as infection or inflammation. Toxic chemicals present in the atmosphere we breathe, in the foods we consume or absorb through our skin from environmental sources, can also cause these damaging events. Irrespective of how these events happen, each error can derail the DNA and cause harm to our health. These daily invasions on the DNA do not affect us because the DNA is designed to protect itself and your health against the effects of these errors. If the DNA is damaged, errors can arise in the path of our genetic instructions, and mutations can occur in our inherited genes, leading to fatal diseases. To protect itself, DNA makes use of unique mechanisms. Cells present in the body are equipped with robust repair processes that frequently monitor the DNA for any sign of structural anomalies. If any is detected, the cells review the numerous batches of identical information encoded by the DNA. The damaged DNA regions are then cut out by molecular scissors in our cells and exchanged with the correct sequence and structure. This process curbs the vast majority of anomalies that might develop on the DNA from being transferred when the DNA duplicates itself. The DNA resorts to another defense system, which works through a response known as epigenetic change. This enables DNA to respond to lifestyle and environmental exposures such as diet by heightening beneficial genes and barring harmful ones. This makes specific genes more or less functional, depending on the conditions. Another key to protecting DNA is telomeres. Telomeres are located at both ends of the chromosomes. They guard the DNA against wear and tear as we age. You can eat to boost your immune system. Do you have a condition where you could benefit from a more effective immune system? Then these foods may be of importance to you. Mushrooms. One of the most common of all edible mushrooms is the white button variety. It can be enjoyed cooked or raw. Garlic. Garlic is famous as both an ingredient and a health medication. Ancient Greeks used garlic to bolster soldiers and athletes and as an ingredient of healing remedies. Fresh garlic has a sharp, pungent smell esteemed for cooking, but the plant becomes almost without smell when it is aged. Aged garlic is found as a dietary supplement and can affect the immune system. Broccoli sprouts. Savory for salads, broccoli sprouts are plant tendrils that have a mild, nutty taste. Broccoli is made up of sulforaphane, which is a strong bioactive. Sulforaphane triggers the immune system. Incredibly, 
Broccoli sprouts consist of 100 times more sulforaphane than normal full-grown broccoli. Extra virgin olive oil. This particular type of oil is heavily featured in diets from the Mediterranean region. The bioactives virgin olive oil contains are oleocanthal, oleic acid, and hydroxytyrosol, which can improve the immune system. Cranberry juice. For many years, drinking cranberry juice has been praised as an effective way to prevent bladder infections. Concord grape juice. This juice is beneficial for its positive effects on the immune system as well as DNA protective properties. Grape juice contains bioactives, such as hydroxycinamic acid anthocyanins and procyanidins, that affect T cells. Other bioactives present in the juice are melatonin and vitamin C, which also prompt the immune system. Chili pepper. Chili pepper belongs to the genus Capsicum. It is also the namesake of the formidable bioactive that holds the heat, capsaicin. The bright red, green, and yellow colors of chili peppers also confirm the presence of bioactive substances such as lutein, beta-carotene, and zeaxanthin, with each having its biological activities. Consuming foods that boost your stem cells to repair your body. A wide range of foods, including cocoa, are being researched for their beneficial impacts on our stem cells. By aiding the regenerative defense system of the body, these foods can help impact everything, starting from counterbalancing the effects of consuming too much fat to repair deteriorated organs. Fish oil. The fatty acid commonly found in fish, omega-3 polyunsaturated fatty acids, PUFAs, is very beneficial to the heart and brain. They decrease the damage caused by atherosclerosis and vascular inflammation. Squid ink. Squid ink, which is primarily found in cuttlefish, consists of a bioactive that protects stem cells and inhibits angiogenesis. Green beans. An element of green beans, particularly the Lady Joy varietal Phaseolus bulgaria, the common green bean, has been proved to defend and improve the survival of endothelial progenitor cells against oxidative damage from free radicals. Many species are cultivated and used in cooking. Foods and beverages with significant resveratrol contents. Resveratrol is a bioactive present in red wine, grapes, and grape juice. It is also present in blueberries, cranberries, peanuts, and pistachios. In nature, resveratrol functions as a biological fungicide to resist fungi that could engulf the plant. So, this bioactive is the first and foremost part of a plant's health defense system. Any type of food that destroys cancer stem cells. Discovering various ways to kill cancer stem cells has been one of the holy grails in cancer research. While it continues to be the primary objective of biotechnology companies researching cancer treatment, scientists have already found dietary elements that can kill cancer stem cells in some forms of cancer. Did you know? Reports from the World Health Organization suggest that 17.7 million people died from cardiovascular disease in 2015, diabetes, 1.8 million and cancer, 8.8 million. Conclusion. Health is about more than not having any particular active disease in your body. It is about the entire immune system and the body's defenses working side by side in ways that are extremely difficult to comprehend. When this happens, the body functions correctly, you feel healthy, and you're able to handle any health-related issues that come your way. As they exist today, most countries' healthcare systems fail in their mission of protecting public health. The focus is more on the care of disease rather than health as a whole, working to prevent disease from occurring in the first place. Focusing on health defenses, first and foremost, is a much better route forward. But, by eating in a specific way and understanding how your body works, you can boost your overall health and well-being. Our health is active and protected by a series of incredible defense systems. These systems work around the clock, from birth to our last day alive, ensuring our cells and organs function correctly. These health defense systems are designed in our bodies to safeguard us. Some are so effective they can even overturn diseases like cancer. Focusing on a healthy diet gives you the control to look after yourself and those you love. Just one step toward a healthy diet brings benefits your way. The most productive way to fight a disease is to try and prevent it from developing in the first place. Of course, there is still a need for research and improvement in healthcare systems to work hand in hand with this. But, by changing your diet, you have the control and the power. 
You can look after your own health and know that the changes you've made are positive ones. Try this. Use the 5 times 5 by 5 framework as a way to eat to beat the disease. You can support the 5 systems within the body by choosing a minimum of 5 health supporting foods you already like to eat. Incorporate these foods around 5 times every single day, varying them across meals and snacks. Thank you for joining us on this enlightening journey. If you've enjoyed our summary, consider reading the full book for a more in-depth exploration. Before you go, hit that like button. Subscribe if you haven't yet, and share this video with someone who could benefit from these insights. Until next time, keep reading, keep learning, and keep growing.